Hey, hello, everybody. I'm Lieutenant Junior Grade Hadley Ellis. I'm from Russell Springs, Kentucky, and I'm a Navy Meteorology and Oceanography Officer. I work at Fleet Numerical Meteorology and Oceanography Center in Monterey, California. So I, I grew up in Russell Springs, Kentucky. It's a, it's a small town on uh, Lake Cumberland. So Lake Cumberland is the largest um, man-made lake east of Mississippi River. Uh, and funnily enough, both of my great grandfathers uh, worked on separate construction companies and both of them helped manufacture the dam and build the dam uh, that made the lake that I grew up on. So I joined the Navy because my family is a service idealized family. Uh, my father was a Marine, my grandfather was in the Army, my uncles were all in the Air Force, and uh, even my brothers are both Marine and uh, Navy as well. And so to me growing up, uh, what it really meant to serve my country uh, meant that I was giving back to the country that, you know, really gave to me. And so that's why I joined. So Finmock is the fleet numerical, um, which cuts down to Navy um, numbers, uh, which really just means that we leverage computers and high level mathematical equations to model the environment. Uh, the next part is meteorology and oceanography, the two areas that we cover all the way from the bottom of the sea floor, all the way to the upper reaches of the atmosphere. Uh, and then centers because we're the we're the one and only place in the Navy um, that really models that entire environment to see what what is going on uh, in our entire globe and how we can leverage that. I think the coolest thing about what we do at Finmock is we really apply what is cutting edge science into helping our country and helping the Navy, you know, leverage what we can against our adversaries. Um, I think really the coolest thing is just is just seeing that science in action, seeing science at work uh, to help our servicemen and women out there. So the Navy is important because, you know, we maintain all the shipping routes and all the communication lines uh, across the world, you know, making sure that you're able to connect with people and, and get your packages and, and all those kinds of things. And, uh, you know, what you really need to worry about out there are the storms and the weather and even our adversaries like pirates and terrorists, right? And so in order to really support those sailors that are out there doing that mission, they have to know, um, you know, the weather, they have to know the patterns of life, they have to know the things that uh, Navy meteorology and oceanography can provide, keep them safe and protect the American way of life.